Hey, welcome back. Hey, welcome back. Hey, this is the Drunk Monk Podcast. We're your hosts, Keiko Gunna. Who you know from the Gilmore Girls. And Lewis Toy. Who you know from your local improv class. And we're here to discuss all things monk. In a drunken fashion. In a drunken fashion. Today we're going to talk about uh, season four, episode three. Mr. Monk stays in bed. But, 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 but we're but, but, not going to talk about it alone. No, 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 we're not. No. No. Who are we going to talk about well, it with? Well-renowned insurance suggester. <laughs> 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 or not. Amber Benson. Oh, thank you, guys. That was, made me feel so warm and fuzzy on the inside. <laughs> She's she's finally here. We've been kind of waiting. So the, the, <laughs> finally, no, but it finally worked out. I'm yeah, saying so get lots of waiting. If if you guys remember, we we said that we had a very special guest that was going to come to the podcast. It didn't work out the first time, but we got her now, and I'm it's here. it's Amber Benson. Who, <laughs> we're so happy to have you. Thanks for coming. I'm so glad to be here and to be slightly. Well, more than slightly. <laughs> I don't inebriated. think you're slightly. I think you're. I'm pretty. F- you're freaking drunk. Um, if I am in reality holding up an empty bottle of cab. <laughs> oh, it's empty. It and is very how empty. much did you have? Like, like half a glass. I, I had like a glass and a half, and I think you had the rest of it. <laughs> did I had the rest by myself? As as it should be. It, it's as called it Drunk Monk Podcast for a reason. That's why I'm doing it. It's so infrequent that I actually become inebriated. I try not to. No, it, it's a very special. Because I'm old. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, you guys might know Amber from Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Yes. And also your book series, The Witches of Echo Park. Yes. You have <laughs> wow. a bunch of book series, though. I, I have, I have two. Book projects, yeah. I have, I have two series that I um, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of burnt out of it. I think. <laughs> I think I'm just kind of done spending a lot of time staring at my computer screen writing words that nobody cares about. Oh, <laughs> people love, people love, people love it. No, there are people who very like, much enjoy. Devil. They enjoy. They're very sweet. It's hard being an artist, you guys. It, uh, well, it feels it like is. you're just like pooping into the void. You know yeah. what I mean? It's like, oh, I'm making art. And it goes in the black hole that nobody cares about. Aww. No, but it's all good. It's all good. But it does feel like that sometimes. It though. Does. I do know what you mean. I, and I guess, and like for <laughs> me, that um, and for 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 all of us too, because we all act as well. It's like that experience for me is the uh, trauma of the of the audition of where mm. because because it's serious, we'll we'll get to monks shortly. But but like <laughs> but this is the thing is is I think that in order to do a halfway decent audition at all, you have to. You have to fall in love. And I'm not saying that in like a namby pamby way. Like you have to actually fall in love with this person and with the people that they love. I mean, you have to be very, very invested. And the harder thing I think sometimes is the aftermath of that, of like mm-hmm. letting go of that. If well, of rejection that is a horrible thing. Mm. This is the majority of what happens it's to you as an artist. Oh, of course. It's everybody going, oh, you're great. You're wonderful. But no. We don't want you. <laughs> <laughs> and that's true. And we all are wonderful. But you actually, like, because I've, I've actually read, like, auditions from, with you. And you give a shit. And you're super prepared. And you're on top of stuff. And I feel like the vast majority of actors. Do you think so? Yeah. I, I always think, think the vast majority are, like, hyper prepared, too. I think the no? vast majority. This sounds terrible. <laughs> I'm a self-loathing actor. Is really what it boils down to. <laughs> I'm also, I'm not a self-loathing <laughs> Jew, even though I am Jewish. Um, I just think the majority of people are in it to be famous. And I feel oh, like, yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. with you, you I don't know as well. Sure. But you I know decently well. And I feel like you truly give a shit and you are very prepared. Right. And to okay. you, it's about the art. It's less about like, what is the art going to give me? It's, mm-hmm. I just want to do the yeah. work. Yeah. I want I want to get, I want to yeah. have the, ch- I want to have. I'm always jonesing for the experience yes. to to be with another human being in a non yes. self conscious way, which is how yes. I live my life. I live my life yes. in some and and not to be a a, a dork about it, <laughs> but I kind of feel like this. The reason why we do, guys, I'm going to break it to you. We do not do drunk monk for the fame. <laughs> 
come now, come now. Uh, well, I mean, you, I got to break it to you, people. This also is an example of wanting to have, like, be able to have an experience with people. That's right. why. Yeah. That's that's why we do this thing. Unfortunately for me, all I care about is the fame. <laughs> so. This is not panning out. It's because you're so pretty. <laughs> Thank you. It's because you're so pretty. Thank if you, so you weren't much. so good looking, Thank then, you. you know. But you're Thank really you good so looking. Much. So, Thank you. like. Um, so, <laughs> what, Keiko? <laughs> what? Uh, what did you get me into? Because I thought that's. Oh, oh, sorry, what? guys. There's been a lot of lying from my end to Will. <laughs> now my uh, nose is now running. It's, now it's coming. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, do are you, you sick? I have some toilet paper have, in my pocket. I wipes. need some wipes. I feel like I could do with some wipes. I know. I, I felt a little because we're gonna Just get into it. Sick. Yeah, we're gonna get into it because oh, wow, this that's... is the episode where Monk is sick, and <laughs> I kind of felt sick watching you. Did, He's that good of an actor. Yeah, oh, I got really tissues. did. I did. Yeah. I felt a little achy. I had like body aches. Yeah, I I really did too. I honestly felt that way. Um, so, so we're gonna get into it. Mr. Monk stays in bed. It's the episode where Monk is sick. And Amber, do you want to do a little recap for our, our fans? If you remember, if you can't, oh, if, no worries. But no, you, no, I, it's, it's all in my brain. Awesome. Well, okay, this guess. is the Amber Benson recap of uh, this episode of So, Mark. um, this is a trite episode because you know immediately what's going to happen. That's not true. It's a wonderful episode because the payoff at the end is actually pretty freaking sweet. Yeah. Yeah. And it does have something to do with some music in a card, possibly. Um, but it's basically, there's two storylines. There's uh, a missing judge who's female who may or may not be having an affair. And then there is a pizza guy who may not actually be a pizza guy. <laughs> um, and then Natalie, who, by the way, Natalie, who the hell is watching Julia? <laughs> yes. I just want to know, like, Number who's one in charge hole. of your child? Because if not, like, if there's not somebody watching that kid, I'm calling Child Protective Services. <laughs> um, that's bad, especially if you leave her in the car and it's hot or cold. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, so Natalie, Monk is sick, and Natalie goes on the, like, detective path. Yeah. And she starts, like, trying to figure out what the hell happened because the pizza guy showed up at their house, and she found the body, and she feels very connected to him, to Julio. Me and Julio are down by the riverside. Is it riverside? Sometimes I, 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 I make up my own. I always make up my own lyrics. People make fun of me. My boyfriend makes fun of me. He says, like, there's something. He's like, you just don't like me. I'm like, yeah, I do. You start with it. It's, you know, you start me with the right. Julio. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, I'm Paul Simon. Simon it. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I'm drunk. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just don't kill me because we actually ordered pizza. You, we did order no, pizza. we did order pizza. And yeah. you know what happens when you order pizza? Someone dies. Yes. <laughs> so I'm worried it's me. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it is. So if you guys, if, if, <laughs> if something happens, if something happens, That's my recap. <laughs> Hooray! Yay. Yay. Insurance adjuster Amber Benson Thank with you. the Thank best you. recap. The best, best recap. Oh my god! Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that was a that was a pretty thorough and good. Oh, yeah. Amber just down that Dang. last line, and I, she is done. Okay, Ooh, I have to. Her. I have to. I have to say something. Okay, we did. We did get two bottles of wine. Oh. Um. When um. Not tonight, but we have vodka if you still if you still no. want some. No. Um. No, when no, Kelsey no. Dara came. Yes. <laughs> but I do think that the speed at which I think, I think Amber has won the speed. Mm -hmm. Amber has won the speed yes, challenge of drinking. Drunk yeah, you alcohol like, yeah. alcohol you goes have... very quickly and like it, it like okay. my the, the drunkenness leaves me very quickly. Oh. So you oh, got okay. you got to hit it hard and fast. Oh, All right. So that's what I did. I just hit it hard. And, it wasn't pleasant. I did not enjoy it, but oh, like okay. it's happening. Yes. Great, great guys. This is gonna be Ooh, a great this is uh, this hour is... and a half. <laughs> Oh no. Um so what did we like about this particular I got I got a I wrote down so much stuff for this episode. Yeah, but what did man, you like about Yeah. Amber, what did you like about this episode? Um I really liked the like the callback at the end. Mm -hmm. I felt like it was a really nice like and I don't want to give too much away. Like, you oh, you can no, say we're assuming that they've yeah, seen it. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. You guys should watch it if you haven't. <laughs> 
to be, be weird and awkward if you had to be very confused by this like I don't understand what's going on um no I just like the Polly Wally Doodle card that Julie gives to Monk at the like medium beginning of the episode like is the reason that they like catch the killer and I just really liked I like a payoff mm -hmm. yes pay me off and I feel good <laughs> <laughs> very sad she's a happy drunk she's a happy yeah, drunk she's a happy I mean, I really, like we said, I love Sick Monk. I love the oh, silent yeah. scream that Monk does. <laughs> Anything that he does that is physical kills me. Because there's a one point in this episode where Monk steps in some kind of goo <laughs> mm -hmm. at the recycling pan mm -hmm. plant, and he has to scream, a silent scream. <laughs> the pan. Silent scream into his elbow. I love that. that was mm -hmm. Oh, you know who was great? Stottlemyre was great okay, in this episode. Yeah, okay, wait. I'm going to have a bone to pick with you. Why? I knew you were going to say that. I knew you were going to say that. Oh. But because it's just like that damn monkey episode. <gasps> you like every time when Stottlemyre's a goof. Yeah. I hate it. I, I just, it just <laughs> kills me inside. It just makes me feel so uncomfortable. No, I love him as an actor, but the, when Stottlemyre is is is. Like, when he's low status. When he's low status, yeah. I can't. I just I I love can't. it. And you love I think it. It's so funny. I think it's so funny. So there's a scene where they're at the country club and Randy and Savelmeyer are gonna question this guy. Uh basically he threatens him by <laughs> putting his tie into the soup. And then Randy's like, Oh wait, actually it's the wrong cable, so it's the wrong guy. So Stottlemyre gives him his tie, and then as they're leaving, Randy's like Oh wait, uh actually that's the guy. So they have to go back and, and Solomon is like, uh, well I kind of lost some leverage in this situation. But I don't know. I thought it was great. And and also when, when Sodomeyer is in the room with Monk when Monk is sick and Monk is great. telling him, uh I'll I'll put the tissue in the baggie inside of the bigger baggie and Which sounds like put the lotion in the basket. <laughs> oh, Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. True. So, yeah, it's, it's, I don't know. I, I think it's so funny. funny. I knew you were going to love that. Yeah, that's good. My butt clenches the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> so I just like, you don't like it when he makes an ass of himself. I, d I for yeah. some reason, it's difficult for me. It, but it's not all the time. It's, it's very it's rare. It's frequent. very rare. Randy was a putz in this episode. <laughs> Randy, Randy did a lot. Putzing. Um, he, he, he made it real, he made it real hard. And he made a real horror. Yeah. He just like didn't give Natalie oh, the time that, of day. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's you know? difficult. That too. was one thing. I don't know. I mean, there are other things about Randy, but that was one thing that was kind of like he just didn't believe mm -mm. or he didn't like help her out. No. But he was very funny though. It was very Hitchcockian. <laughs> because there's a lot of like not believing what's actually happening. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Because yeah. she's like, No, I know. And everyone's like, No, you don't. And she's like, No, I do know. I'm in his house. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, guys, women's voices matter. That's straight. Yeah. And we're going to the march. Amber and I are going to the march. Well, Amber, are you right. going on to? the twenty first. Yes. Yes. So just are you so there? We are so gonna there. Go. But I'm just saying. I'm just cool. saying women's voices matter. Listen to Hell women. Yeah. Hell believe yeah. them. Hashtag believe women. <laughs> anyway. Don't on. grab them, just believe them. Don't, them. <laughs> don't misunderstand my hashtag. Yeah, yeah. Don't grab them. Just believe, believe them. Just believe. I believe the truth. Ooh, the truth. Yeah. Ah, ah, someone is here. Oh my god. Yeah, I mean, I wrote down so much <laughs> stuff in this episode about this episode. Like, yeah, like we said, Monk being sick was amazing and the fact that he felt like he had to eat the alphabet soup in order <laughs> so oh good my God. that's so oh, good you. and the different here's what happened because we've been kind of making note of the the different ways that the show does the here's what happened part of it that was brilliant it was so mm -hmm. good because he's telling the here's what happened to the killer over the phone flip phone <laughs> over flip the phone, phone. <laughs> yes yeah yeah it dated it so <laughs> wow, oh, I Natalie made so me so nervous. <laughs> My poor liver's like, you fucking bitch. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Oh, um, I will say though, that card was so annoying. It was annoying. <laughs> that card was well, annoying. Do all the day. Fairly yeah. well. Fairly well. Very well, my very fair. 
I had no idea they had lyrics. I'm from Alabama. I know the fucking Bolly Wally Doodle song. I also know, oh, Susanna, for me. Because I gone through the end of the world. I know on my name. Which is not in the song. Yeah, it's not, but uh, <laughs> it's not. But it could have been. It could have been. I'm it sure that was been. one of the ideas floating around. So hey, yeah. Okay, go ahead. No, no. I'm just saying that card was in your battery. I know. Okay. Well, well we're gonna, we get we're to gonna get into that. We're gonna but, get into that. Okay. This is this has not anything to do with uh, what I liked about this episode. But I'm gonna <laughs> ask you. I'm gonna ask you something, Amber. All right. And this is because when we're watching the episode, <laughs> I can't somebody, help myself. Um, so somebody gets hit with a garbage <laughs> bag, and out of the corner of my right ear, I hear this comment. Amber saying, uh, you know, I've, I've hit people with trash bags, and they don't fall like that. <laughs> yeah, that's probably not the most appropriate comment to be making. Um, no, but I just had to ask, like, why? At what point were you hitting somebody with a trash bag? Oh, I'm pretty sure that my sister has been hit by a trash bag a couple of times. We used to beat the bejesus out of oh, each other. Oh, for real? Did you oh, really have a tough time with your sister growing up? She's the best. I love her so yeah. much. But we used to beat the shit out of each oh. other. Would, what's the age difference with me? Because I met your sister. What's the age Four difference? Four and a half years. Really? You're okay. older or you're younger? I'm the old one. Oh, you're the older one. I'm the older one. Okay. Um, but I'm shorter. Mm. She's bigger yeah. than me. And there hit a point where she was bigger than me. She and I was had, like, had enough. Yeah, and she's like, "You're gonna, you're gonna pay, you're gonna pay, yeah. old lady." So this I stopped being. I was really nice after that. I'm like, "Here's a gift card." <laughs> <laughs> but she's yeah. the best. She's actually she's amazing. She's studying Eastern medicine. She's about to go to China again for the second time. Oh wow! She's just like super cool. Like you know, there's always like the the really cool sibling. Yeah. Do, can I just tell you? Because I've met her sister, and there are people that um you hear, "Oh, that person's cool," but you're. Your sister, like, she's super cool. Just is cool. She oh. just is cool. She's not, and she's not Hollywood cool. She's like no. actual cool. She's like real person cool. Yeah, oh, wow. and she has the best tattoos. She does that I've that I've ever seen. It's and it's all not real art from her it, friends. Yeah, and I can't describe what this looks like <laughs> to you, but um, because it's 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 not something you're gonna find in a tattoo parlor. No. No. It's completely original. It's yeah. these delicate line drawings. It's like. My it, poor dad. <laughs> another one? Really? Another one? Oh, geez. Really? Another one? All right. Well, and you guys are super close now. Yeah. She's yeah. amazing. We were always really close. We just, because we're so close, we beat the shit out of each other. Yeah, of, yeah. of course. And I'm bossy. And I admit that freely. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I am a bossy bitch. But you guys, something's happening. Something magical is happening over here in blue. Orin Melodica. Orin's on the Melodica today. Orin's on the Melodica again <gasps> today. So um, you're in for a, 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 a real treat. Amber, do you see him? He's oh, fluttering oh, around. Yeah. The bat, the bat with the bat. I do see him. He's yeah. beautiful. He is yeah. beautiful. He's I am a fan. He's mesmerizing. He's mesmerizing. 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 <laughs> and um, guys, okay, the person who says quietly just for us. <gasps> okay. I'm trying to keep eye contact with the other. That, that we have not been introduced to yet, but um, that the other that that will we have not been introduced to yet that is not, it's just sitting perched on just the watching, window sill, just, just watching, hanging out. I'm sure Oren, in his time, will introduce us. That's his business. <laughs> Nothing special. <laughs> we don't know. Don't think. Don't think. So, Orin, would you like to play us in? Plot holes. Like butter. Like butter, like Orin. Butter. Like butter. Uh, so, this is the section where we talk about plot holes. Things that don't quite make sense plottles. in the episode. Plottles. 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 A couple of plottles. A little bit of a plottle. A plottle here and a plottle there. <laughs> yeah. Uh oh, the hair went down. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> I have to. I have to like put it on the bottom of my head. I should brush it, but I forget. No, See, I don't is, forget. This is why we take our photos at the beginning. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I did unleash my hair. That is a mess that I did not brush. <laughs> I was. I was actually. Um, uh, somebody said that I had an '80s thing going on with mm. the like poofy, like heart hair. 
Well, it's really just to attract Orin, but now he's got Lady Brand. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I'm sorry. sorry. I'm sorry. I feel a little, like, broken. Orin's broken a lot of hearts. Yeah. My heart is like a small little pea mm. now. Mm. <laughs> Brokenness. So, uh, <laughs> we're going to talk about plot holes that happen plot holes. Sure. in this episode. Yeah, let's. Yeah, let's. Uh, Amber, do you have any anything that you noticed in this episode that didn't <laughs> quite work, didn't quite jive with you? For me, I just was like, who's watching Julie? <laughs> Right? You, you kept on saying that. The I did. Episode. I said it like three or four times in my Who is watching Julie? Hashtag who's watching Julie? Yes. Yeah, who's watching Julie? Because people go to jail when their children are left to their own devices. Right. Like, yeah. we're a little, like, I'm not going to say, I'm going to be 40 in January. Well, I'm going to say, I'm going to be say 40. It. I'm going to be say 40 it. in January. Oh, yeah. 40 in January. I live in Alabama, Birmingham, Alabama. Nice, nice Southern Jew girl. Um, <laughs> but we were free to like go wherever we wanted, sure, and like when it got yes. dark, and then uh-huh. you could come home. You yeah. know, like they're like basically like go play, mm-hmm. go out into the world. Um, now it's like everyone's like on top of their children and helicopter parenting, and right. I feel like you know, like what's going on? Like Julie's just free balling it out there in the world. Like who's yeah. in charge of her? Well, we've talked about this before in a previous episode mm-hmm. where we we both. I think I was. I don't know. I I grew up similar to you, where it was just like we just played until my mom yeah, so like called us home yeah. to eat dinner, yeah. and you know, and uh, over time it shifted where kids just don't play outside anymore. No, they do not. They don't. They're never unsupervised. Yeah, yeah. it's always supervised playtimes. Yeah. yeah, 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 play dates and whatnot. Yeah, yeah. so it, it's shifted, but yeah, we're... because I think that was the whole thing about getting a bike. Because Ooh, a bike yeah. represented freedom. Because mm-hmm. if you got a bike, that means you that meant you yeah. could go anywhere that you could ride to. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Can I say there's I have a friend, I'm not gonna out him, but he, he's <laughs> he has a sixteen year old, um, fifteen, sixteen year old kid who mm-hmm. has no interest really in getting a car. Huh. Really? He's like driving. And I think that's I can't a, I can't say anything because I did oh. not get my driver's license until I was twenty. Five years old. Oh, why? <laughs> I was... Where were you before LA? Where were you no, no, no. I was here. I was here in you LA. Were in L- you were in LA? Yes. I, this I, is a car town. I know it's a car town. Um, I was working on Buffy, and the Teamsters would be like, if you just get your driver's license, they'll give you a parking <laughs> spot. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Did they drive you everywhere? No, my Did they mom drive dropped me off. Oh, your mom was oh, one my. of those. Gosh. Oh my god, you were so. Wh- I was well, one of those coddled children that like <laughs> had a stage mom who wasn't a stage because she was like she wasn't a stage mom because she would make me go into auditions by myself when I was like 14, 15, 16. Yeah, and wow. the other mothers would all be in there and they'd be like, "Oh my daughter has a cancer. Why are you here?" And I'd be like, "Oh my god, oh, I don't oh know. I just am here." It was like very unsettling. Wow. My mom would wait in the car. <laughs> It's like, wait, you, you're you like a fake stage mother. So so you, Whoa. your mom was here in L.A. with you. So you've yeah. been here for a while then. Yeah, I've been here since I was 14. Oh, wow. I'm going to be 40. I've been here a fucking long time. <laughs> Somebody help me. Hashtag in L.A. too long. I want to go. I want to run away. I need a Metro card. <laughs> I drive now, but not well. So, so your mom <laughs> not well. I have a fucking callus on my left hand, right there on the middle finger callus from holding the steering wheel too hard. Remember, that's too hard. That's too you hard. should not have a driving too callus. Hard. That's, that's too hard. That's too hard. That's too hard. Need driving gloves. <laughs> I get so nervous. I'm just like squeezing the wheel. I'm like, please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Pedestrian, stay away. Wait, so your mom dro- dropped you off on set? She did. When, did you get your car after Buffy or while it was going on? At the end of Buffy, I got a driver's license. Oh my god, hilarious. Isn't that embarrassing? No, that's so wow. funny. It's just like, I don't, so know, funny. I don't know how, how a, an actor can survive in LA without a car. That's just to me. Oh, it, I had a car. I bought a car. I just didn't <laughs> drive it. <laughs> I had someone else you drive had a car for me. Oh a my god! So your sister moved out here with you because she was younger than you. Yeah. Mm. Oh, it's like the ladies, the ladies against the world. But then the world is like, oh, ladies, why are you like like on top of each other? You need to go do other things. Uh huh. Uh huh. My sister went to college, oh. and I 
stayed with my mom. And I love my mom very much, but she's very intense. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I wanted to ask, was Buffy and Monk on around the same time? No, Monk is a lot. I think it was a half. It was I think after. it was after. Okay. I, think. I always think that Monk is such an old show. It's not that and old. And it's no. not actually that old. No, because we've been we've been off the air with Buffy like fifteen years. Okay. So Monk was late, a little later. Yeah. A little, a little, but a little so, later. but did little you later. watch Monk when it was on TV? I did. You did. I did. Okay. So I like mysteries. I'm a big mystery buff. Yeah. yeah. I watch all the British mysteries and all the American. I watch all the mysteries. I read You're all a poor mysteries. world fan. I am a poor world yeah. fan. I am a poor world fan. <laughs> <laughs> I do like him. David Sachet. Am I saying his name right? We're we're nowhere near uh, able yeah, yeah. to correct you. On yeah, that. Oh, we can't. I do love me some Poirot. <laughs> but I'm a big reader. Oh, cool. I like uh, the books. That's why I you like the books. Of, yeah, you the Christie, because I like her very much. Oh. She's one of my favorites. <laughs> did, did I go, you, I go fake read, Russian when, I, when I'm drinking. Did you wow. read uh, any of the Monk books? No. Oh, and you I haven't. I haven't. Yeah. I watched the show, but it's not difficult. Eric Sh- Patterson gave me oh. when we did um last year because oh. you know Eric Patterson very I well. Eric. I love him. Um, gave me a monk book as mm. a best secret Santa or oh. elf thing this which were, and and a Jim Beam. Yeah, yeah, that's did like you, the best present ever. It was. It was <laughs> kind yeah. of. It was like so thoughtful and sweet. Did you fun. see the tweet uh recently where in the books Ambrose Monk has an assistant who's Asian American? <laughs> what? That's what? what? Can we bring the show back and do that, please? I think we have a clear winner uh, winner right here. Chicken dinner. Um, I love you, John Turturro. (laughs) Come back and do a show, a spinoff. John Turturro. John Turturro would never do a show, but um, (laughs) but wait, who knows? Who knows? Oh my god, I love him so much. Yeah, Uh, I got to meet him for a second on uh, uh, Transformers because he was there the same time I was. Doing the thing, I get to eat lunch with him. I was very cool. quiet. I just observed him observing. <laughs> I I know we had mentioned that uh we were getting pizza, uh so hold on let me let me grab the pizza. Oh, is it here? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Hi everybody, I'm pizza guy. Oh. Hey, I'm pizza. <laughs> I'm not Greek. Uh, I'm Roman. Did, um, I, 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 hi, yeah, uh, we ordered one extra large half. Oh, you only get one size. There's only one size and small. But it's a small pizza. We ordered an extra one. Oh, it's not small. We don't know anything that's small. It's called small pizza. Okay. Uh, but you should have known, well, it's called small pizza. I, small, small pizza. Excuse, it's called small, okay, small pizza. Excuse me, what is your name? Bob. Bob. Okay, Bob, the pizza guy. Um. Okay, I know it's called small pizza, but it's not small pizza. Can I name it? Oh, so you're the I owner. Am you're the owner. I'm small pizza. I'm not Greek and I'm not Roman. I'm not like Caesar's pizza. Not little Caesar's no, okay. big pizza. Big small pizza. Okay, that's um that's the second time you said you're not Greek and not Roman, but I don't know that Will or I accused you of being <laughs> Greek or Roman. Also, isn't it Italian and not <laughs> Roman? I got it. Better business bureau license oh. so that I can have <laughs> small pizza. Why you gotta fucking harass me? Oh my god, I'm so oh, sorry. Oh, we, we didn't mean oh, to make oh, you angry. Oh. Bob, I'm so sorry. Um, I just, I saw your pizza place on Yelp. It said Bob. Bob's small pizza. Did you pizza. like it? Did you like, did you say like, 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 like? Well, we were going to wait till we oh, saw yeah, what the experience oh, was before we. Oh, my God, Bob. This is the tiniest pizza. This is this a, is not even a small pizza. Oh, oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No, 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 no. Do you see that there's three of us here? There's me. There's Keiko again and Amber Benson. Who... No. Who the fuck is Amber Benson? <laughs> I, she's an insurance she, adjuster. She, <laughs> she like it on Yelp. Amber, did you like it on Yelp? Uh yeah, I did actually. I don't know oh. what you guys are doing, but I don't oh, know. Like, oh, okay. She's well, much nicer. Yeah, she's nicer. I was well, okay. Well, I loved her review actually. Oh wow. Well, you're probably gonna fucking review. <laughs> oh my god, Bob. Bob, Bob, Bob. Um well, okay, so how much did the pizza cost? I, I guess I couldn't yeah, hear just... how much it was over the phone. It was four hundred and forty four dollars. What? what? No, no. Normally no. doing more than four. Okay, this pizza must be the that last best time. pizza we've ever had in our lives. Oh, yeah. 
It's almost like um an amuse bouche. Like when you go to a fancy no, restaurant, it's like no, 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 it's not Papa John's. Okay. I did not say yeah, that. Yeah, we didn't say that, but, but okay, it's not Papa okay. John's. Can we at least just try it before we see how much um if we're gonna pay for four hundred forty bucks? Forty four. Forty four, okay. Here, here's a piece. Okay, go. Take okay. a piece. Okay. Amber, have a piece. Um, Amber. Okay. You're but I don't know. Amber are you? Tiny. Oh my god, it's so small. It's um, like a Barbie pizza. It's like a hot looks doll pizza. Very different. Okay. It's plush. Let's all let's all uh let's all put it in. Okay. Um that pepperoni. Well, this is actually pretty good. I taste um goat cheese. Hmm. So you like it. It's pretty good. It's it's done. It's over. Yeah, the experience was quick, but the taste feels long lasting. It's called micro pizza. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's micro pizza. It's micro pizza now. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, um, hey, Keiko, do you have four hundred forty-four dollars? Forty-four cents. Forty-four cents. Okay. Amber, do you have that much? We can split it. I do actually. Oh my god! Right? I do oh. have that much on me. I was buying a Christmas present for somebody, and they didn't have it anymore. And so now mm -hmm. I have just the remainder of the Great. money that I was supposed to like give to the. Um, oh. So I can write a check to the pizza guy. Okay. Um, okay. okay. Um, I guess Amber's gonna cover. Thank you, Thank Amber. You, Amber. Really Appreciate nice. it. You're so welcome, you guys. Thanks for buying me a stancy of wine. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. So I guess Bob, we're. I don't know that I feel satisfied, but I guess we're. Good. Yeah, I guess we're good. Thank you, Bob. Good. Okay, I'm gonna go kill some people now. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, he's gone. He's gone. Wait, 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 I, wait. The last thing that he said, though, was that he was gonna go kill some people now. <laughs> Do you think that's on his agenda? I don't know. <laughs> God, now I'm feeling really grateful that I said that I liked the pizza. Right, yeah. What if now, we, yeah. What if we said no? I think you would have. That was a little strange. He was just a strange. Yeah, he had he was real shady looking. He was kind of Beetlejuicy. He looked like Michael Keaton, but with like you know like yeah. Greek and Roman kind of overtones. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that real Greek Roman vibe about. <laughs> well, he was wearing the toga. Yeah, I think that's what it was. Yeah, I think that was. So, so when you see toga, you think Greek or Roman. Or Roman yeah. Um, I don't know that I go to a third thing after that. Oh. College? But college. he didn't leave oh, a yeah. tool for Animal college. House. Mm, I go yeah. to the Animal mm -hmm. House. Yeah. I was a little scared of him. I'm really bummed that he has your address. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh. Well, what is your address again, Will? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. Uh, Whoa. Wow, we're still in plot holes, <laughs> yeah, you guys. Sorry. Okay, we're plot. still in plot holes. What? Okay. Plot holes. Okay. Um, face bright red. <laughs> no, you're, you're good. It's a glowing pink. Mm -hmm. It's a glowing pink. You're, somebody in my family said we have Blackfoot Native American in our in our family genetics. Blackfoot oh, for real? Native so, American. Yeah, so I think that's why alcohol affects me so intensely. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay, I'm gonna call you out because you said you were lightweight, but you drank. Oh, I am so fucking <laughs> drunk right now. It's not even funny. I am so shit faced. Like if I if you told me to leave your house, I would go into your closet. Like, <laughs> That's what would happen. That's how drunk I am. Like, this is a lot for me. This I'm just is, like, we love it so much. We love it so much. You guys aren't, you aren't a hundred, you aren't like as drunk as I am. We, we took we it a not. little, I mean, we, we maybe not. drank, uh, okay, Keiko had two. I did have two beers. two beers. You did have two beers. I'm finishing up my wine. But the the thing is the speed. I, it was the speed. I because if I speed. if I if I pace myself, then I don't get that drunk. Mm. Oh. Okay. If I drink quickly, then I get sure. really drunk. Sure. Yeah, but then it's gonna be over in like what ten minutes, right? Yeah. So that's yeah. why I did it. Cause it was like we're doing drunk month for a <laughs> <Wow, laughs> for a reason. Amber's I, real making out with that pop <laughs> screen. <laughs> I have spent so much time. Amber, with this Amber, pop I know screen. you. You've been alone for a while. <laughs> I'm a lonely girl. <laughs> a long and winding. <laughs> Leads me back to the pop screen store. <laughs> wow, that pop screen has not gotten that much yeah. attention. It's I really enjoying it. it. I love it. It's I real love happy. It. I almost passed out on it, quite frankly. <laughs> I just keep leaning on it with my cheek. Yeah, you're my really, baby's bottom. You keep on caressing that pop screen. <laughs> I love you. I love the pop screen. I love you so much. Why don't you love me the way I love you? Tony Shalhoub, why don't you love me the way I love oh, you? Oh, I know. Oh, I think oh. you guys have to fight over Tony Shalhoub. Oh, I can't. 
No, I, I will yeah. I will seed him to you. I give you him to you. You have a long standing love for the man. Mm-hmm. You do. You do. I like rosemary and thyme. That's where I get my jolly back. Right? <laughs> what? What'd you say? You never seen the rosemary and thyme on the BBC or the ITV or whatever the fuck it's on? <laughs> What is that? Oh, it's another mystery series. Oh, all right. All right. I'm a big fan of the two ladies. They're very okay. funny. Mm-hmm. They do um gardening. Uh huh. And they always find themselves in the middle of a murder. I don't know why. Um, it's it, great. It's, I highly oh, recommend. Nice. Okay. It's not as it is not as like on par as like. But smart, is it? Is it, Hulu, is it on Hulu or? Netflix I think it or? might be on the Netflix. It's okay. definitely on the Acorn. Okay. You know, heard of the the Acorn is the like British version of like Netflix. Oh. Oh. All the British mysteries. Oh, cool. okay. Is yeah. is Witches of Echo Park? Is that a mystery at all, or a little bit, a little bit of a mystery? <clears throat> okay, <clears throat> it is a little bit of a mystery. <laughs> oh, I got the job. Um, <laughs> it's a little bit of a mystery. It's a little bit. A little bit. It's a little bit. It's basically my love letter to Echo Park. They lived there for mm. hundreds of years. Like years. Uh-huh. I loved Echo Park very much. Now yeah. it's super hipstery. Mm-hmm. And so yeah. like I kind of don't like fit in there anymore, so I moved. But gentrification. <laughs> yeah. But Echo Park was my my like my space, my place. Mm. A lot of really cool, like arty communist sort of like things happening in the fifties mm-hmm. in mm-hmm. Echo mm-hmm. Park. Nice. And then, then it became very hipstery, like in the two mm-hmm. thousands. <laughs> mm-hmm. mm-hmm. So yeah, I just got tired of seeing penises, really, is what it boils down when to. When did you see penises? Well, not really, like, yeah. <laughs> fabric-covered. Like, okay. the dudes wear their jeans so tight. Oh, I got it. But you yeah, see yeah, yeah. the outline mm-hmm. of the penis, and I was like, mm-hmm. I, can't, I can't do this. I need to be These where men wear pants. dad jeans. <laughs> dad pants. I need to be around dad pants. Like, I'm too old for, like, tight pants. <laughs> We got to go back to the time uh, in the early 2000s when Monk was, where everyone's wearing kind of Yeah, there clothes. are no skinny jeans. No skinny no, jeans. No, there are no skinny jeans. Just ties. That, just, just ties, ties yes. There was, ties play predominantly. Lots of ties. The episode. This was a tie. Tie episode. It was a tie episode. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, other, what other plot holes do we have? I mean, I wrote down a lot, but... Um, yeah, uh, tell us your plot holes, you guys. I, okay, well, guys, come on. <laughs> guys, can come on. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh big one's going to come up. How is a card, a battery for a card going to be alive for 10 years, you that's guys? That true. was a big one. That was no. A, it's not. And, okay, not. also, those cards work when you when you close them, they turn off. Yes. yes. That is correct. Yeah. That's correct, Will. Yeah. That, I mean, I understand. What if it's glitchy? It is, you know, but I mean, I understand it's all part of the the plot. But I mean, guys, come on. Yeah. That was a big one. That was a big one. I agree. What else? else? I think she was too good of a Samaritan because uh, we watch (laughs) Natalie. uh, So she gets a $50 bill as change, the incorrect change for her pizza. (laughs) And she gets in her, she she doesn't catch the guy. She she gets in her car and drives Mm -hmm. to catch him. That's too much. That's pretty. That's too much. That's a bit of a good Samaritan. Okay, guys. Too much. I will say, this happened to me recently. I found 40 bucks on the floor. Oh, okay. Buy, okay, so I I have a job where I pick up a kid from school. Uh, mm-hmm. I'm not creepy. This is part of my job. Um, <laughs> they pay you. They pay me to do this, yeah. And I found 40 bucks on the floor, and I was like, I can pocket this. This 40 bucks I need. I'm not rich. I'm very poor. But something in my conscience was like, ah, oh, it doesn't, I can't yeah. do this, you know? So I went to the school, and I was like, hey, do you guys have some kind of, like, donation situation that goes to the school? And I gave them 40 bucks well i know i'm such a good person you guys person. oh my god you're a very good person thank you but i honestly thank i'll you. be completely honest i wouldn't have done it if the kid wasn't there yeah. <laughs> good for you good for you right right because he was like oh no, that's true that's true he was the like what are you gonna do you with gotta, the money gotta, yeah. what are you gonna do with the money no you're right you gotta yeah. you gotta show a good that's when you know. comment yeah. and tell him you did that and then don't do it and yeah just like go into the office but put yeah. it in uh, my pocket and then walk hey. out hey. Super yeah. Super yeah. Super Super sneak. just check it on like you know pizza drive i also this also happened to me one time too i was at uh disneyland for my uh, senior year kind of like uh, graduation 
thing that the school does where seniors go grad night it's called grad night mm. i found a hundred bucks on the floor oh my god and that's I, a big one yeah i what waited you do with it so i i found it right in the entrance of thunder mountain and i waited there for three minutes yeah. just in case someone would come yeah and claim it right and ask hey, hey did is, is there any money that was dropped Obviously, no one did. No one did. So I just bought everyone dinner. Oh, Aww. I know. I'm such a good person. That's nice. Such a good person. Oh, hashtag Will's a good person. I know. I just feel weird about that money. Like, I just, I don't like. Look, it's not yours. It's not mine. It's yeah. not me. Well, but I was at the Whole Foods and they're like trying to bring out my Japanese eggplant. It's just a regular eggplant. And it's like $100.29.99. cents. And I was like, dude, it's $1.29. It's not 99 cents. And he's like, but let me just keep you it for now. I'm like, no, it's a dollar. <laughs> that was a joke you guys it did happen and i did lie i mean i didn't lie i said like it's a dollar 29 but yeah. like that's a joke will is a much better person oh than no 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 we're all good people it's all the same it's all the same you guys mm-hmm. except mm-hmm. keiko she always yeah, just pockets. I, have no, I have no pockets. comment <laughs> pockets. i have no comment oh my God. um oh, i know i know man now it's hitting you oh yeah. now it's hitting you. Like somebody like beat me with a club. Oh no! Um, did you get bludgeoned? She's down in the Canada Dry. Mm-hmm. The Canada Dry. Yeah. Can, can we talk about the 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 okay. woman, the the judge, Ju- mm. Julian? She got beat up by that bad Dude, man. It's not right. It's not right. Mm. That's why you can't have uh, women judges. The nice no. things. <laughs> <laughs> Women's March, January. You can't have nice things like women judges. Uh, women judges because obviously they'll sleep with people and then get themselves murdered. Duh. They never really like, lesson learned. They never really talked about like so he's a lawyer and they're fraternizing with each other. Yeah. Just, I but like I think that's kind of okay. It just depends on like if there's like a case being tried. They kind Is that of true? Yeah. So if he's not on a case that she's yeah, I think it's totally fine. It's fine. It's not a conflict. Oh, okay. Yeah. I mean, maybe, maybe someone were... will ride in and say I'm fucking wrong, but very well. <laughs> oh, there was a lot of comment oh, on gosh, our yeah. on our. They're gonna they're, gonna they're gonna go crazy. <laughs> they're gonna go crazy. <laughs> but I would think like, so you can't the judge can't be a lawyer rep. Doesn't make any sense because yeah. kind of to be a judge, you kind of have to be a lawyer first, right? Yeah, I would think. So. I don't know what the rules are. Yeah. But I don't know either. Yeah, I think that was a little a little shot. Yeah, that yeah. was a little plot hole question. Um, also, another plot hole was definitely, we talked about it, the trash bag fight. That, yeah, 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 yeah. The trash bag. That, that was guy was of... weak. <laughs> he was just rolling around. He two people. Know. Yeah, Monk could, like, Monk sick could best him. Right. Trash bag. Plot, yeah, major like, plot hole. Uh, like... And also, Natalie, get out of the house. Natalie, don't go in the house. <laughs> also, Natalie, don't call Monk on the other line, because it's a funny joke. Just get out of the what i loved was that he <gasps> the killer uh dennison he forced natalie to help him look for a pizza right? box He's while she was up. like her hands were tied oh like, i know she so could have just ran away That's so funny. easily he had a knife it didn't make any sense that part was uh yeah but it made for a good uh rescue but yeah like, it didn't yeah right. it was it was a monk well, the tide patrol came and got her what the tide patrol some yes, the Thai Patrol. Yes, the Thai yeah, Patrol. Thai Patrol. <laughs> San Francisco PD. <laughs> <laughs> but the other, um, oh, also, last thing. Um, mm. So the f- bloody fingerprint was on oh, the light switch, yeah, but it was hidden in the dark position, which means that he was cleaning in the dark. Well, okay, you know what? Actually, I take you that back. It could be during the day. But he was cleaning in the light because the light was on. The light was on. He, he killed her when it was dark, but the light was on. No, but he so. killed her during the. Yeah. Oh, did he kill her? Oh, you know he did kill we her, really but know. we don't know when he cleaned. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna take that back. Number but two. how does he know that it's not like a flip switch? That it's like a like you know like one of those like those up slides. and down. Yeah, it was like a slider. It was a slider well, versus maybe like also a, if it's a, it's switch. a flip switch, there might be a little fingerprint, a little yeah, piece of a little, light, a little piece. Of but light. you know, I don't think you can even do a full scan. Oh, but it's not a fingerprint. It's yeah, blood. Yeah, it's blood. It's so blood, if it yeah. was her blood, okay, I retract. It's a retract, blood yeah, print. Retract, retract. Debunked. Monk yeah. plot hole debunked. Um. Oh God. You know what I love though. What? Going back to what we love, how that the Denison guy was was like when he when Natalie came to his house and was like, 
<laughs> you know what I'm talking about? When, when she's like, oh, I lost my cat Cats. snowball. And he's like, oh, let me show you. And got the her in the basement. Oh, God. That was the no, best the cat part. is black. <laughs> that was the best part because he, like, he obviously knew that he was yeah. kind of caught at that moment. And it was, it was. <laughs> Now Amber has moved to the po- to the point of the relationship where she's beating up the uh, oh, <laughs> the pop no. screen. Pop, poor pop screen. It's just it's a flaccid pop screen. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't stay erect when I'm oh, yeah. You make me feel bad about it's this all single morning. I'm sorry. It's a, it's a inefficient. Why you gotta pop have screen. a pop screen <laughs> that like loses its erection? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't know. I just thought that was funny. Um, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Wait, what did you say? <laughs> just, oh, about, about the, just about the about guy. The guy. Being so like, I've lost my train of thought. <laughs> <laughs> the guy just being so oh, like. We just yeah. started, Amber. We haven't been recording until it's now. Wrong that every time you say Denison, is that guys? I think of Denty Moore beef stew. <laughs> what is that? Is that a song for Denty Moore? Probably. I, I, I think probably. That I think I ate that like when I first got to LA. I <laughs> think I might have eaten a little bit of stew. It's like ramen. Oh, it's like very inexpensive. Yeah. it's like fast to microwave. Yeah. It like yeah. makes you feel full a little bit. Yeah, I don't think they have it. Is it like a cup noodle? Yeah, it's like yeah. well, it's a well, stew. It's like a, oh, it's like stew. a stew. Oh, Denty it's more. <laughs> <laughs> Like I was gonna sing the fucking theme song, you guys. Can you sing it? No. Oh, okay. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I just know well, Denji well, Moore. <laughs> the stew with the poo. <laughs> poo stew. Ew. Ew. Yeah. <laughs> Three of those rhymed. <laughs> woo! I woo that's, the day. Oh, that that's I, five. Woo and roo. Woo and roo. Woo roo. Mm-hmm. There was a rap in there somewhere. Yeah. I can't rap white shit. Mm-mm. You can't? <laughs> no. I can't either. Can I'm the whitest of white girls. I can barely dance. Is the poo stew and the woohoo. <laughs> you hoo. Woohoo is a lovely under, under marginalized breakfast drink. That's me. You hoo? Right for you. That's oh, right. Right for you. It's not a breakfast drink, but it feels like it's it not a best. Be. But isn't it like it's called chocolate drink and not chocolate milk? Because it's not actually chocolate well, milk. milk. Oh, do you think it's not actually? No, milk? it's not. Oh, it's, oh, it's not. definitely it's something not. Else. It's called like chocolate drink. <laughs> <laughs> so gross. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. We reached the point in the evening where the majority of Amber's comments will be snorts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's true. You, isn't there a rabbit just associated with you who somehow? Uh, yeah, I think that's mm. a rabbit. No, that's, that's quick. That's quick. Nestle quick. quick. Nestle quick, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Do you, have you, uh, are you like a snorter? Is that yeah. kind of like, yeah. that's just the thing that it's just it happens. It's just it just it happens. happens. That's funny. I can't help it. <laughs> I try, I can't help it. I try, I try, or and I try. Oh, or and try. Wait, and I try. Uh-oh. What? I okay, try. I'm just gonna ignore that this is happening. But Ooh. is that Aaron's lady? <gasps> oh, I, I, does she no. have a name? Oh, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> hey, Oren's uh, Oren's girlfriend. Um, is there a way you could like maybe spell out your name so we know what to call you? Yeah, can you spell oh. out your name? Well, she's she's scraping on the wall with her little bat toe. Yeah, what is? It? Can you read it? What does it say? It, I think it says Cecily. <gasps> that's a beautiful. That's name. a really cute name, Oren and Cecily. That is. That's a, that's a spinoff. Uh, how how crazy, crazy was Mark this episode? episode? That is beautiful. That's sweet. That's very sweet. He's in love. Sweet. He's in love. He's in love. He's in love. Where's the love? I hear. So I hear hearts breaking all across this nation. Yeah, mm-hmm. mine is breaking. I know, Amber. I'm sorry. My pee heart I'm, broke. Your pee heart sorry, broke. Amber. I'm sorry. Um, so how crazy was Mark this episode, you guys? Out of, out of what? He wasn't that crazy. Oh. Was he? I don't know. I don't know. Okay. He wasn't in it that much. 
he wasn't. wasn't. He, was, he was actually he wasn't. He Natalie. was. It, he was yeah. not. It in was. It, that it was much. definitely was a Natalie, Natalie episode. Yes. episode. Yes. Yeah. Which I can appreciate. I definitely. I think. liked the Natalie. Um, I'm gonna say out of ten, monk humidifier. Oh yeah, there were right. a you're lot. Right. There were a lot. Humidif- humidifiers. Three at least that I counted. I'm right. doing the number three with my fingers. <laughs> yes. Yes. Like you, you are. Claw. I'm clawing you. <laughs> <She's> <laughs> Guys, she Amber Benson just clawed me right now. Yeah, she did. <laughs> out out of ten monk humidifiers, monk humidifiers, how crazy was Monk this episode? You're right, he was crazy. Well, do you do you? Eight. Yeah, you I would say eight. Oh, eight, eight out of ten. Eight out of ten. Eight out of ten. There was a lot of there were a lot of bottles of alcohol and a lot of bottles of super mm-hmm. and like three humidifiers and there's a lot of like acting. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Definitely. I'm going to give him... I think it was six, right? No, 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 no. no. I'm going to say... I'm going to say like 8.75. <gasps> That's pretty high. That's pretty high. I'm going to say eight. Eight. <gasps> yeah. Yay! So we're all in the ballpark. Yeah. yeah. Because there were a lot. There was all the six... The, 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 the two levels... And the fact that he gets his level recalibrated at the hardware <laughs> yeah. store yeah. twice a year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um. Uh. What? One of the the crazy things that he did that I did like was his temperature was ninety nine point nine yes. degrees, and Natalie was like, "Oh, it's a hundred. So that like <laughs> it kind of like yeah, you know, it just I like that a lot. Out. I did like that a lot. I thought that it was very too. funny. It was very apropos. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. Um. And and all of the the Ziploc stuff. Very Ziploc heavy. Yeah. Do you see the like twine around the garbage bag at the end? That yeah. Was pretty yeah. Intense. Yeah. And and I think the the one of the other funniest things was him on the phone with Natalie and saying <laughs> like he had Ebola. Oh. oh my yes, gosh. He he's, he has Ebola. He thought he had Ebola. Well, he's a hypochondriac. He's a hypochondriac. It's hypochondri- like it was 2014, yeah. 2015 in here. Yeah. yeah. He's like it's yeah. pre the crazy Ebola stuff. Mm. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Mm. Yeah. Do you guys watch? Do you guys watch the this movie in high school about Ebola outbreak? Outbreak. Yes. Yeah. Did you watch that? I did, did you watch that? I love like mysteries about viruses and diseases. Yeah. I love reading about viruses. Really. And diseases. I love the hot film. It's great. Oh, really did I read that? Book. Just might have read that. It's what the outbreak app. Uh, oh. Yes. Outbreak yes. 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 Yeah. yeah. I think I read that. It's like a mystery. It's like Monk. Yeah, but with like little microbes. Amber, did you ever read The Stand by Stephen King? I did. I see it right here. Oh in my your gosh. Book. I read it's it so late. Good. I read it like the last like, I read three it, years. Yeah, it, like maybe two or three years ago. Yeah. It's basically about an outbreak that kills yeah. like oh, wow. n- most of the 90% of the. Most of the people. And then uh, the man yeah. in the, the, the like, the, the, like, the, the, the dark, what's the, the, the dark man? The that, dark man? Or <laughs> the man in black? The man in black. Man in black, black, yeah. The man in black that also, is Idris Elba. He just no, it Idris wrong. Elba is. Oh, that's right. He's the gunslinger. He's the gunslinger. Matthew McConaughey mm-hmm. is the mm-hmm. black, man in black. And, and right. Aaron Paul is the. What? Aaron Paul is the, oh. the other, the druggy guy. Oh, yay, Aaron Paul. Yeah. He is you know Aaron Paul is very nice. Really? Oh, do you? How, how, yeah. how do you know him? Oh, we're such a fan. Just like yeah. an actor, he's that whatever. He's like he's lovely. He's such a sweetheart. Oh, yeah, he's he's a good, he seems like a cool guy. Do you know that he like? I think it was Jeopardy. No, not Jeopardy. Jeopardy is Price is Right. He won like some. Oh yes, I saw. I saw Price the ad, right. yeah. Yeah. clip of that on him on Price is and Right. And once upon a time, my mom and I went over to look at the chair to maybe buy it for him. <laughs> he's such a sweetheart. He's a good egg. <laughs> That's yeah, cute. That's I'm cool. obsessed with Bojack Horseman. I've seen it. Oh my god, Bojack! Uh, three times all the yes, way through. Yes, Bojack is so great. It's so, so great. Good. That show is so good. It's such a good show. It is good. It's so great. Um, <gasps> I also. Uh, Sorry, I keep sniffing my <laughs> armpits because. <laughs> I got a new deodorant and I don't like it. It doesn't work very well. No. Oh, I'm sorry. It just doesn't, it um, doesn't do what I thought it would do. Can Can I also say this thing? A lot of Asian people don't wear deodorant. Really? Okay, yeah. stop bragging about Asian no. people. Hey, hey, no, 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 no. It's, it's just a thing. Well, okay, Kore- Korean Americans are the least likely to uh, have That's not fair. body odor. But that's interesting because also um, earwax. 
it's it's different it's, based on mm-hmm. yeah mm-hmm. Uh, Asian American. When do you right. find That's that right. one Korean American that does have body hair? It's mm-hmm. real bad. Yeah, it, it, is, is, it is. It is bad. It is bad. It is <laughs> real. No, no, no. Real. It's and bad. like that person like scooped up all the body odor. <laughs> <laughs> and other people left. It's true though. And it's then true. they claimed it for themselves. It, 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 there's there's studies on it, and um, I I don't wear deodorant myself. I hate deodorant. Huh. But I mean, I sweat, but I just don't smell. smell. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, um, Jesus, I'm sorry, fair. I'm sorry. But it, I, even bitch. even, <laughs> <laughs> but even Keiko, Keiko you're says, about to be hit with a garbage bag, oh, no, right? Oh, no, 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 give me, give, Amber, stop. Oh, Amber, oh, where'd you get that? Amber, where'd you get that? I didn't that even know bag? we. I didn't even know we had a garbage oh, bag oh, in here. Oh. Uh, you, you deserve. Know, I've been putting my dirty tissues in there. All oh, time. yeah, because you've been. You've and been I put my pizza crusts in there too. Oh, they're not Greek and Roman. <laughs> <laughs> they are the kind of pizza crust that you put in a bag and get rid of. Nobody likes them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Tom's deodorant does not really. It doesn't. Oh, okay, not for you. Okay, I guess no, not. not no, no, not. Thank you, not for me. Not for yeah, you. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna do the thumbs. <laughs> thumbs we're gonna do the thumbs, thumbs down, down on the Tom. Uh, thumbs down on the Tom. Get on, ladies, you get an ladies. anti anti endorsement. Yeah. It's not awful, but it's not great. Sure, sure, sure. I like I like the 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 like the men's. What's the what's the men's um the men's stuff? The old spice. Old, old spice. Old spice. I like right. old spice deodorant. I don't like the aluminum, so I like the old spice. Oh, you like the aluminum? I don't oh, like. Oh, you don't. Yeah, I thought you thought. So I like, I like the old so spice deodorant because it does not have aluminum mm. in it. Mm-hmm. Aluminum is what makes your uh, if you wear white shirts. Uh, oh, to go like yellow? Is that what it is? Yellow? Like it turns yellow. Oh, okay. So, okay, okay. Um, I know that only because my roommate, he is Korean American, is one of those people. No, oh, no. That that's not fair. Deodorant. See, I feel pity. Pity, because that's not fair. Yeah. Like, it's fine that it comes to me, the stink. I understand that that is just what happens. I'm a mutt. There's a lot of stuff in here genetically. <laughs> I don't like cilantro because it tastes like soap. Oh yeah, there's. I'm those, one of those, those people. people. Yeah. I gotta do the DNA thing to find out where I come from. Mm-hmm. But I feel bad because yeah. that's not fair. Yeah, I mean the no. one person that like has to just yeah, yeah. Right? no, it's a, there's a couple. By right? Menon. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we do. Uh, Asian Americans do have the dry earwax. Uh, which, do as well. which yeah. I didn't know that wasn't a thing. I did, had no idea. Yeah, I have stinky, gross earwax. It's like a Caucasian person. Caucasian. Caucasian person. Whoop whoop! There it is. Caucasian person in the room. So Caucasian. I'm not even a real Caucasian. I'm like a mixed Caucasian. 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 What does that even mean? I don't know. Do you. Oh, okay. Her her sweater. sweater. uh, Amber's sweater just ate Amber's head. Do you know what all you, like your ethnicity oh, is? Yeah. Like, I'm I'm Austrian Russian Jew on my dad's side, mm. and then I'm like English Scottish and Irish on my mom's oh, side, wow. and then also black but Indian on my mom's side, on wow. my mom's side. Wow. So I'm a I'm a I'm a mm. true American mutt. <laughs> I'm tough. a mutt, tough. <laughs> and I don't like cilantro because it tastes like soap. Uh, it's there's there's people I know people that are like that. It's, I, apparently, it's in your DNA. I could, don't like cilantro. I can uh, kind of taste it, but it doesn't bother me. That oh, it's much. horrible! I hate it so much. I pick it out of everything. Wow! Cilantro, ew, ew. You like <laughs> cilantro? You know what? I I did had a change because oh. when I was in oh. uh, middle school, I thought I called it like the devil's herb. Or something. <laughs> <laughs> this is why we bond. I hate it. Yeah, I hate it. it. But. It is. But I, but later on, I, oh. I think when I moved to LA, when I moved to LA, I started because in Hawaii, I really, I had like the, that knee jerk reaction where I, it, it ruined food for me. It, yeah. it, it ruined oh, everything totally that I even and but now I. Kinda, but LA now is now so like cilantro centric. Yes, it there is. is a lot because it of is. all the like, yeah. the, like 
California Mexican food mm-hmm. yeah. is very similar to heavy yeah. meat, which is also very very good. Mm-hmm. But very and also in pho, they put a lot. Of, like, oh, that's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Which is, right. of, I do love. Vietnamese kicks your yeah. butt with cilantro. Yeah. 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 Which is to me, it's my favorite thing. Can I tell you though, like something that surprised me? There is a um, oh jeez, Louise, I'm getting old and my brain is falling apart. <laughs> I want to say it's oh, it's a dumpling. It might be a Afghan, like an Afghani dumpling. Oh, I might not know. Could be okay. wrong. There's a place in Glendale that um that is that is that kind of like thing. Middle Eastern. Yeah, but it's like Afghanistan yeah, yeah, dumplings, yeah. and they put cilantro in it. Ooh. Oh really? It was like a Jonathan. The restaurant was a Jonathan Gold like. Pick. Oh okay. And yeah, it's yeah, yeah. so you it's, ate there, and you were like, oh. No, I no. did. I ate there, and I was like, yeah. oh, I can't. I was like picking the cilantro out of all the dumplings. Yeah. But it was yeah. delicious. Oh wow! So it's good. Good. It's in Glen. It's in Glendale. It's in Glendale, which... where we are. Hey. Yeah. Okay. The... <laughs> really close to the mall. Oh, it's in Americana. Mm-hmm. By the Americana, and I forget the name of the restaurant, but it was delicious. Okay. Keiko is, Keiko is laughing uncontrollably because Why? Uh, if 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 uh, you don't know, Keiko has this running thing where she likes to uh, make fun of Brenda. No, no, no. She likes to disclose where I live. Oh. So my last place, I had to move from there because we were getting some weird neighbors because oh. people were. But also a lot of love. A lot of love. Okay, yes. inappropriate love. I granted. Did but people try and come in your window? Yes. Did you come in your window? Oh. A little. <laughs> well, there was that one time. Little, yeah, there was that one time. <laughs> there was that one time. But uh, yeah, yeah. She, that's why she was laughing because you said Glendale. But we had uh, <laughs> Sorry. someone else had already said it. Another. Uh, oh, I don't okay. mean to, right. to to blow your cover. No, don't worry. You're cover good. your blow. You co- yeah, don't cover my blow. Um, <laughs> Nobody needs to cover your blow. You yeah. just do your blow. Just blow. Just, just do my do blow. It. Don't cover just it. Yeah. Blow. <laughs> Blowing in the wind, like Do- like Dolly Parton, like Dylan, Dylan Dolly Parton, Dylan Parton Dolly. <laughs> Uh, Amber, how, where are you right now? Amber, where are you right now? I don't know. Are you no, with, literally? Are you with do us? you know where you yeah. are? No. Okay. I'm on, I'm on a pizza somewhere, and it's not Italian, Greek, or Roman. Well, we ate, well, Amber, ate, we ate it. Amber, do you not remember that we ate? Oh, it was little, wasn't it? It was. It was I mean, although I think for the size, you should have ate the crust. I'm just saying. Yeah, I know. I, regardless, I gave it a positive like, Yelp review because I can't. But help you myself. did that before. I know before I ate it. Pizza. I'm a horrible <laughs> reviewer. I review. Just don't do of, like. I don't know, guys. I have to tell you, do not bonus. trust the reviews of Amber Benson because she's right, going to review it before. The owner doesn't want me to review, and I just review. Without actually eating. <laughs> I don't eat. I review without eating. I'm a reviewer. You're <laughs> not real. I'm, uh, Jonathan Gold would smack me in the ass. <laughs> he would tell me, Benson, eat before you review. He would. He, he would. would. He would. Oh my gosh. Well, I don't want to leave, but I think we do have late. to. Look, it's, eight, it's very late. It is. It is late. Um, But what, is there any other last minute? How crazy? How crazy? Uh, Oh, how, yeah, and in the last minute, how crazy is? Is there anything else that you want to say regarding the how crazy? Um, I like his tie. A lot of great ties in this episode. <laughs> <laughs> no, Amber, you can't Amber, start Amber. from the beginning yeah, of your yeah, notes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's, um, that's yeah, what I you would watched. Focus someone <laughs> would follow me around with a giant Ziploc bag <laughs> for my tissues. I can't believe he something kid card. Um, two humidifiers, so many. Bottles of Pepto and alcohol. <laughs> she killed him so many times. Long time. Long time. Sexual attention Ebola. Ebola. <laughs> and then John Delancey, more time. Wrong title. Um, okay. <laughs> you can't intimidate witnesses. Man kissing. <laughs> Man kissing. What? What's man, man kissing? Is that another notebook? Is that a note for something? Else? Yeah. Never go in basement. Oh, oh never go in never go in basement. Are yeah. they connected? He's not married. <laughs> Valentine's Day. Sometimes people don't spend it together. <laughs> oh yes, yes. Is that That's true? true. That's Who true. is Julie? <laughs> Game vampires can't stop. <laughs> the Oakley Inn lawyer. <laughs> Amber's literally, Amber, literally Amber, going through just all go of her through notes. All of your notes and just say words. Amber. He must, but this is the takeaway. 
This is my okay. takeaway from okay. TikTok. Okay. You must it? really love Natalie. Mm -hmm. That is a good takeaway. Mm -hmm. That is a good mm -hmm. takeaway. Fare thee well. Fare thee well. Fare thee well, my lady. Run right on the lazy end, board a game of lazy end. Come right here all day. Amber Benson. Amber Benson, everybody. Amber Benson. I have, a, oh I have a, a, a website for insurance people. Too. <laughs> I, I adjust insurance. I really hope someone out there who's listening to this is like, oh, I should contact her <laughs> for my insurance. Never. <laughs> never, never. Um, but where can, other than your beautiful website for insurance adjusting, where can people find you if they want to find more information about you, Amber Benson? Uh, Where well, are there's you? Wikipedia, which lies. <laughs> okay. Oh, um, lies. And then there's there's the Twitter, which is Amber underscore Benson, but I post very infrequently since the election. No. Mm. Because oh, I feel awful. No. Oh, I hear you. It's so fucking awful. Sorry. Yes. Uh, Trump, Trump is not my president. Uh, He's somebody else's. I don't know who. Yeah, not, not ours. Mine. Definitely yeah. not ours. No, no, no. All of us are going to be in. As, as our friend Tom Wong says, we'll all be in internment camp. Oh, oh, no. You know, as a Jew, as a Jew, I, I, you know, I'm ready for the number. Bring it on. Don't bring it on. I don't want it. As horrible as that is. All right. Um, is, is there any projects that you have coming up? Oh, gosh. There's stuff, but none of it comes to fruition at this point. So, but do you, uh, how about your book series? Uh, oh, yeah, you can yeah, go to the bookstores and you can find The Witches of Echo Park. And the second book is called The Last Dream Keeper. <laughs> the third book is called The End of Magic because fucking A, that's where we're at, people. No. It's fucking A, no magic. There ain't no magic in this world. It's just that. Um, sorry, it's not actually true because the beauty of what we do is that we're artists and mm -hmm. we make beautiful art. And that will transcend and lift us up out of the crap. I love her. Yes, fucking in crap. <laughs> I know, yeah. Yes, I, I, we need you artists out there. If you're out do. there. We need to activate all of the um, artists. Truth. Work truth. it. We gotta Make work it. That. Make Build good it. stuff. Connect good it. Stuff. Watch, uh, watch it. Um, uh, Preston Sturge's, um, why am I blanking on the name? This is one of my favorite movies. Oh, God. <laughs> What is the name of the movie? Preston Sturges. It's called um, <laughs> Sullivan's Travels. So, and Travels. it's all about like making art because art transcends everything. Mm -hmm. So watch that and then go make some fucking art, people. Yeah, Thank that's you. So watch amazing. Monk and hang out with these lovely people Aww. because they make good art. Thank you so much. Thank you, Amber. You. It's the truth. And Amber, they... can we get one more snort for the road? <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so on that note. So remember, be safe. This is a jungle out there. Mm -hmm.